let's check out some of the other tools inside of Outranking. So we can look at the search engine results analysis. I'm going to type in affiliate marketing. Let's do the top 30 results. So it's collecting that data, and we'll see if there's any way that we can use this. So you can download the information here. Uh, it is giving you the content length for each one, how many links they have, um, you know, how hard it would be to beat, like how optimized it is. So you can see there's some pretty, pretty challenging ones. Uh, here's some of the external site links people are using, internal links people are using, some of the related keywords that I believe Google suggested. Now let's look at questions. And we'll type affiliate marketing and hit submit. And here it's grabbing questions. I can download those. Looks like it, it grabbed 402 questions from this particular one. So it did related keywords for these ones. Uh, d these are ones that were answered on actual web pages that were ranking probably in the top 10 or top 20, maybe top 30. And then here's some Google suggested ones that probably people also asked. Now let's look at their SEO content. So uh, we can do a new document here. And I want to just do affiliate marketing for my query. And we're going to create a new Yes, that's fine. Okay, so this is stuff and I can, you know, write my own content. I can, you know, analyze things and, and go back and forth uh, with it if I want. I can import uh, content. So let me share with you the one I imported. This was one of my own pages. Uh, that was this one. And here I imported my frequently asked questions. Gives me an SEO score of 100, which shows you know, how many words are on my content compared to the average and the maximum. My readability, how many senses I have, what different sections I've got, um, the exact searches that I'm targeting, some links that I have, some images I have. Uh, it doesn't seem to see my images when I import, so that's something to, to bear in mind. And then it talks about, um, you know, some of these other things if I wanted to be pillar or regular content. I'm going to, have to switch it to pillar and see what it does. It gave me a 95 score, so there's probably some stuff I could improve here. We'll see if we can figure out what those were by the related keywords. So uh, there's some keywords to do, sections. Um, I could do some more here so I could add outline to editor so I could target some of these things if I wanted and it should put them over here somewhere there's a lot of words on this here it added it right here and it can look for sections from search engine result pages I like I can copy all those and, and put them in so that's kind of handy if you're uh, doing this I can do popular uh, keywords and, and put them in so if those are things to hit so it does help you organize your thoughts with the writing that you want to do so you can have this content brief or you can take your existing content and then you can copy and paste this into conversion AI and let Jarvis uh, write and expand on your content for you. So that's just another way of doing it, another popular tool that uh, I found called outranking.io and you may be interested in checking it out and I'll put a link to that underneath this video.